Hi everyone, I'm Diana with Mimi's Life and I am back today with another Timu haul and um, I'm going to try some stuff on today. I was going to save everything and just uh, have one big try on but yesterday I tried on those flannel shirts so and so today I'm wearing my um, chicken shirt and my chicken earrings that match so good together so I thought well I'll just go ahead and try this stuff on that I'm showing today because it's mostly clothes I got some jewelry and some eyelashes and um, I think one or two deals of makeup but that's about it it's not a very big haul and um, so I'll just try it on. So I was wondering, how is everybody today? Um, we're all okay around here. It's fairly early. Miss Abigail's still sleeping. And I thought, well, I'm going to jump on here and do my Timu haul real fast before I go out and start doing my errands today. But that's what I have on today. I have on um, my Timu shirt and my earrings. And this is a bracelet that I got from Timu. It's got the magnetic back on there. I just love it. I've got like three of these and I love every one of them. But, and I have on my blue jeans that I got from Amazon. Um, I'll put the camera down so y'all can see them. Uh, this is what they look like. I really like them a whole lot, but they're still just really high. They're really high up. So, and the only thing is that they have this distress piece right here, right at the pocket. And I don't really like that. I keep thinking that my pocket's showing, or inside out. <laughs> so, anyway, that's what I'm wearing today. And, uh... I will just jump on into my haul. I'll start off by showing y'all these pants that I was talking about yesterday um, that I got for Abby. It's another three pairs of those joggers that are super duper thin. I don't even know if y'all can see how thin that is, but they're really thin and they're really long. So, I don't even know, what do they say? Oh, uh, Los Angeles, California. But, I'm thinking I might return these because they're not, they're not really thick enough for what I want them for. I, I need them to be a little thicker. The beige ones have like, the little butterflies, and the black ones have this little design on the leg. But, I really wish they were thicker because I would keep them. I mean, they're they're made well and everything, and I love the colors of them. But just you know, she would be able she wouldn't be able to wear them whenever it got colder, and that's really what I was kind of hoping for. But you know what? If I would read the direct, if I would read the description, I might know what they were made up. You know. A little bit better but I don't so so next I got her another little of those um, little fuzzy dresses that I like so much for her this one's just a little pink one and it's super soft just super duper soft and I like these for her whenever it gets cold. It seems like whenever you have hardwood floors all through the house. And, I mean, I have throw rugs down everywhere. But, it just seems like it. And she, I cannot keep her in socks or shoes if she's at home. She will not wear socks. And, you know, you get up in the mornings whenever it gets really cold. And it's just so cold. And she won't wear socks so I have to put her on something pretty warm so I got these brown leggings that have the um, the fuzzy stuff on the inside for myself and look at these like 
I don't think that the, these could stretch enough to fit on my body. <laughs> there's no way. I mean, I know they're supposed to fit you tight because they're like tights, but I don't think there's any way that these could stretch out enough to fit on my body. So, I don't know if the girls want them or not, but they're really warm. And um, I'll show y'all in here uh, a top that I ordered to go over them. So, I do, I was checking in my drawer and I did have some brown ones. And they're, they're really easy to find, like at the thrift stores, you know. So, I'll probably just look for me a pair in there. Because these were only like $5. They're really, you know, inexpensive. But, I just don't want to keep having to order them, send them back, order them, send them back. You know, that's a pain in the rear end. So, I'll just wear the ones that I already have for the shirt that I got for them. Um, <clears throat> before I jump on into the, well, I'll just go ahead and show y'all the clothes. I got this shirt right here, which I love. I think it's super cute. And I don't know if y'all remember last year, um, whenever I ordered several, several of these uh, sweaters and I have like six of them and they have so many of them so many different patterns and and colors of them and everything and I loved them so much last year because they're thin they're super thin like they're good because our weather is so weird here in Texas like it could be in December or whatever and we'll still be hitting like in the 60s you know just some last year we hardly had a winter so um these worked for me last year so i thought this one was super cute i didn't really need it because i have so many of them that i can wear from last year but i really liked this one a whole lot it reminds me of the scripture in the bible about the one lamb so anyway I thought that was really pretty. So, this is the shirt here that I got to go with the brown leggings. And it's that, oh, uh, whatever you call it, this pattern that it has on here, this check pattern. But I ordered one of these in orange, solid orange, and I liked it a lot. And then I ordered one. I can't remember gray and then it had a, like a fall um, stencil or not stencil but you know iron on or whatever on it a fall one and I really liked it so I got this one but the reason why is it's so long like whenever I hold it up it goes all the way down almost to my knees and I thought this I thought that would be so cute with the pair of brown leggings underneath it. You know, with the real cute pair of earrings and just some plain white tennis shoes. Only thing is this string that they put on here is like a white shoestring. It just totally don't match, but I mean, whatever. So, you know, this is nice to like go to the grocery store or just hang out around the house, just something really comfortable. So that's what I'm going to do with that. Give me some brown leggings. Or you can wear black leggings. You can wear maroon leggings underneath that. Um, different, A lot of different colors can go with that. So, okay. I got a solid yellow one. And after I got these solid color ones, y'all you, you know how I am. I get on one thing and it seems like I have to have it in every color. So I got this like mustard color in it and I thought well I've never tried to order one of Timmy's iron-ons but they have so many cute ones and I thought instead of having so many plain ones that I've ordered because I got a um, that beige one now and I got this uh, yellow and army green and a black one I thought I could try one of their iron-ons 
and do it but I think what I'll do is if I try one because they're so cheap they're just like a dollar or something I might get one and experiment on an old t-shirt that I have around here before I you know go to messing one of these up but because I can I can really mess some stuff up when it, <laughs> when it comes to stuff that you are trying to put together but it has the, you know, these all have the pocket in the front, like the kangaroo pocket. See, I don't know why they wouldn't have put a brown one like that. You know, it's got the metal on the end. Would have looked a lot more. That kind of looks cheap, but. So, anyway, I got the yellow. I could get me one if I was that worried about it and feed it another one through if I wanted to. So, I got an army green one because I have a pair of camouflage um, hay dudes that I thought would look cute with this with just a pair of uh, blue jeans or a pair of black leggings as well. These are not as long and they have the, the band that goes around the bottom. So... They're really soft. They're really comfortable. And if it got really cool outside, you could just, you could throw you on like a turtleneck underneath that. Would look really cute, like dress it up. Or you could just wear a plain t-shirt underneath it or, you know, whatever if it was cooler and you wanted to warm it up a little bit. So I got this shirt, this Strawberry Fields Forever. It said sweatshirt on there, which it's not. It's just like a heavy t-shirt you know and I got this in a 2x they're all in 2x's so it just it doesn't have the fuzzy stuff inside it's kind of hard to find one with the fuzzy stuff inside you know so far this year I've ordered several of them and none of them are fuzzy so anyway I got that I thought this would be really cute with a pair of leggings or um just a pair of jeans so it's cute I need me some strawberry earrings. So, here's another one, guys. I told y'all when I buy something I, that I like, I really buy something that I like. So, here it is in black. And it's one that just has the band around it. So, whenever I try these on, I might just try on one of them instead of having to try all of them on because they're all going to look the same. I think I'll try on the golden one to just see what I look like in that color, you know. So, that's that. And then I got another one that, it's kind of a black or a really super dark gray. It's a 2X. And this one on here says, live by the sun, love by the moon. <laughs> Whatever that means. But I thought it was cute and it was really cheap. It was like six dollars. So, but, and it's got the rim around it. Even these two X's, I mean, if you wanted to, like, if you're my size and you wanted it to be really big and baggy, you're gonna have to go to like a four X on these things. So, but, anyway got that one and that's all the shirts that I got so I'll jump over here and show y'all what jewelry I got while I take a drink it's so nice today it is 70 degrees here today it's a beautiful outside so I got me some eyelashes just some more of those clusters what would anybody do with these? Like, I don't know. Like, these, these three rows right here, like, I end up just throwing them away. Really four rows. No, really five rows. About five rows I don't wear. But I've been looking for them on there where, in this one as well. You know, about, yeah, that row, about four or five rows on this as well, too. But 
I, I found on there on um, Timu like this pack right here. Of course, it's got the sticker right in the front. On this pack, you can buy these, which I messed up again because I bought these and they're too light. You just, my eyelashes already look like this. But this is D plus 13 MMs. And they're all 13s. So you can order these and they're like 85, 80 something cents, 90 cents. And you can get three or four rows of all one size, which that's what I wear. But these are so light that I will probably give them away. So I got another pair of tweezers. I love these tweezers from Timu. They really work good. And I've gotten several pair like different color Whoop, I thought I dropped it. Different color ones, but the purple one that has this kind of slant seems like it works the very best to me. So anyway, I really like these a lot. I've already ordered about four or five pair of them because every time I turn around, the girls are, do you have any tweezers? And of course, they don't give them back. So I ordered these because Tara wears these like crazy. They're just those pimple patches. You can't see anything. They're just clear. But they are expensive in the store. They're like three to three dollars and up. Like at the Dollar General or the Family Dollar. I haven't seen them at the Dollar Tree. Not my Dollar Tree anyway. I'm going to go to the Dollar Tree today, so I might have a Dollar Tree haul. Maybe not this weekend because my husband called. But anyway, there's a lot in here. A whole lot for like, I think it was $1.90 something. My husband called me and he's like, did you get my text? And I was like, no, I didn't get it. My phone does not beep loud enough or whatever. I need to adjust all that because everybody texts me and I don't see it until I sit down to mess with my phone. So, um, he's like, he got Oktoberfest tickets. So, he wants all of us to go to the Oktoberfest um, tomorrow, which I already had plans because I was going to go out and see Debbie, the other grandma that lives um, out in Dallas. So, I was going to go out there and we were going to spend the day with her tomorrow. But, he was like, well, I got tickets. I didn't know you are going to Debbie's house. And... So I can go out to Debbie's maybe Sunday or next weekend. But anyway, I guess we're going to go to Oktoberfest tomorrow. It sounds like fun if my leg will hold up. <laughs> I love doing stuff like that. I love to go to like the Oktoberfest and, um, you know, all of those that come into town and, um, and I used to love to go to Six Flags, not to ride the rides because I'm scared of heights. But I used to love to just go and walk the grounds, you know, and and watch the kids enjoy themselves. But ever since, you know, my legs need to be replaced, it's, it's really super, super hard for me. Just like when we went to Florida and I had to walk through that sand, that sand was the hardest stuff ever for me to walk through. Because my leg gives out. I just, I need to bite the bullet and have my, have my left leg fixed. But my problem is, guys, is before I put it off for so long because I had all three girls and I had them in school and it was hard for me to work around them and so I just put off my surgery because of the kids and finally I just had to do it. I had no good legs at all and I was like I've got to do it I've got to at least have one good leg you know it was hard for me to cook it was hard for me to stand and cook or clean the house or anything so now you know I'm still it's still restricting me my life from doing things that I want to do like simple things like go to this Oktoberfest and walk because my leg is literally bone on bone, so it's just rubbing like this every time I walk, and it's so painful. So, 
and now my deal is is my son works and I have to keep Abby and I'm thinking well next year Abby starts school maybe I will you know schedule for the surgery to be in that in that time I just don't know guys I, I try to work it around fixing myself around the kids and it just sometimes it just doesn't work out but I need to have it done so bad because it's just like going to this Oktoberfest I love going to that kind of stuff and looking around and looking at all the you know hippies and stuff and um, it's just hard on me so enough of that get back to this what I'm doing so okay I got these earrings right here because you know I got that um, shirt a couple of hauls back that said gobble till you wobble and it has the um, the turkey on the front so I got these to go with that it kind of looks like the same turkey so I thought that would be really cute to wear around Thanksgiving time So, let me open this box. I was gonna, trying to keep, you know, in the same order and I kind of started talking and forgot what I was doing. I do that a lot. So this is um, an eyeshadow palette. I don't know what it says. I can't read that. It's really pretty. This is like feels like metal it doesn't feel like plastic but I don't know if y'all can read that or not but anyway it's really pretty and it's beautiful colors oh look at that let me do some of them ooh look at that one It's like you, you take the top off and it's really sparkly and then underneath it's not as much sparkle. It's really pretty. I haven't had, I haven't had very good luck on Kimu's eyeshadow. So I was like, Dazzle Bright Number 9 color eyeshadow is what it says and came in this box of course you can't tell anything because I put the sticker on both sides but it's really pretty colors I like it a lot I hope I like this one so I got that and I got this pretty ring it's two pieces um, it's a band with some stones and then that big diamond and I got this in silver and in gold because it was like a dollar twenty seven so I hear somebody outside the window but that's what that looks like it's really pretty it's very pretty I got that. Sounds like they're right outside my window. So I got this because I'll show you I don't have them all right together. Oh, well, yeah, I guess I do. I'll just go ahead and grab all of it. Since I didn't order, they didn't, um, I didn't order them all together. I ordered them separately, but I'll show you. I got the ring the fall leaf, the ring, and I got the bracelet, which is really cute. It's heavy too. It's got the little butterfly on the chain. It's so cute. And then I got the earrings. Whoa. But this will look so cute 
um, with the gray um, long sleeve hooded deal that I've got so many colors in. It has a fall scene here and it's got some leaves and stuff on it and this will look really cute. The whole set will look really cute with that. Plus I have some t-shirts that I ordered that have the fall scene on them as well that has those fall colors. So I got these earrings because I thought they were so pretty and they will go with the the orange um, long sleeve shirt that I got. I like them because they're not real big and they're just kind of the perfect size. I got that. Guys, I've got so many headbands and I still buy headbands because I think they're so pretty. I just need to get the guts to wear them. And I know y'all probably tired of hearing me say that. So I got this bracelet. I'm always seeing this bracelet and it's like a dollar. So finally I was like, I'm going to order that. So it's really pretty. I just wish that this wasn't so long and this wasn't so short here. They kind of made it kind of backwards or something. But that's kind of what it looks like on. It's pretty. And um, do y'all watch Material Mom? Angela so they're on their um their cruise she's been posting some really cool stuff that they're doing it's fun to watch I've never been on a cruise and um, I've never really wanted to go it's been kind of uh, scared of that for some reason so here's another little ring that I got. It's very dainty. It's really cute. It reminds me something of uh, maybe Jen would order because she likes these little dainty rings like this. I think that's really pretty. I should just keep some of the jewelry on because I didn't. I don't have any rings on because I knew that I had all of these. Uh, rings the haul and I thought well I'm just not going to put any on because I'll be trying them on and here it is in gold I ordered it in white and uh, silver and in gold I really like it in gold I think it's really pretty so I like that I'm more of a big gaudy type person when it comes to rings now this one is really pretty. It comes in two pieces and here's the band just full of diamonds. And then here is the other piece. And that is really pretty. I really like that. I don't know what size I got but it's kind of big. I thought I got it just in a 7. So I got that one, and then here is that um, that square diamond in the silver. It's two bands, so there it is in that, which I like that. I think that's really pretty. So here is the headband that I ordered. And it's a, a dupe for a um, Gucci, I think. And I just thought it was so pretty. It's a really good dupe. So isn't that pretty? Pretty, pretty. None of the girls wear headbands. I don't know why. They just don't. Probably the same reason I don't, because I don't think I look right on them, but I love them. I got me some of these because mine are always come up missing. I needed some eyebrow brushes, so these were like a dollar. So I ordered me a couple of these. It was come uh, two to a pack for like ninety-seven cents. And I ordered some of these nail decals. This one here has, um, I think I can wear this all the time. It doesn't have to be at um, Valentine's. It's just 
some little nail decals that have love and I really didn't want them for the red hearts as much. I just wanted them for like the love, the little love deal right here. Whenever I go with a different color on my nails. And <clears throat> let me take these out because the, the, um, <clears throat> the reflection from the oh there's two to a deal these are really cute these are Christmas ones this would be really cute with like your red your uh, nails painted red and maybe do all you know like red and do like a silver one here and then put like some decals on them they stay on too you're really supposed to um Put them on and then put a clear coat of nail polish over them, which I found mine to stick really good without the nail, the the coat of the polish being on there. That way I didn't, if I got tired of it, I could just scratch it off and I didn't have to, you know, use fingernail polish to remove it so it wouldn't mess up my fingernails. So here's another one with just some more love stuff. I don't know why I did all this love stuff. It looks so valentine-y. But I think it'll be alright. So that's what that one looks like. They're cute. They're cute. So guys, that is it. That's everything in my haul. I'm going to try on these shirts and let y'all see what they look like on me. And I will be right back. Okay, I wanted to turn my camera a long ways. I'm sorry to have to do that so y'all can um, see more of this shirt. So this is this one. It hits me about, you know, right there. And see, this is a 2X. It's not very big and baggy at all. But it's not very soft. I mean, it's not rough or anything. I guess it is soft. It's it's all right. I mean, I guess if that inside bothered you at all, if you had any kind of sensor, which Sadie does. She's got really bad sensor problems, and she can't wear a lot of stuff. But this is cute. I like this. This would be real cute with just jeans or leggings. This kind of looks like the same shirt with different decals. And these decals are not real, you know, what do you call them, rough. So, <clears throat> this looks like the same shirt, just a different one. But I like it. I said I wasn't going to try all these on. I mean, I'm not right now. This is super itchy. It's a very itchy on the inside. The orange one that I have in the closet and the gray one is not like that. But this is itchy and it has no stretch to it. See that? This is a 2X too and it is tight. This is definitely going back. Okay guys, y'all tell me what you think about this shirt. I don't know if I like it or not. I think it'd be cute with some leggings but I'm not crazy about this. And they're not the most feel-good shirts. Like, I'm having second thoughts about this, these. So, I don't know. I think it makes me look like a cow, for one. And I just don't know. I don't think I like it. I don't like this at all. But, I mean, I could fix this if I had to. This one is softer than the yellow one. That one feels like a sandpaper. It's terrible. So I'll just have to see on this. I don't know. It might feel better after it's washed. But the yellow one was too tight. The band was too tight around here. So I don't know. What do y'all think? Okay. I think this is adorable. It's really cute. And it's soft. After you wash it, it'll be you know, even soft enough even more. It's nice and giving. It's very giving. And I just love the color of it. And I like this one a whole lot. 
I think it looks really cute. You could even put black leggings with this, but I would most likely wear it with a pair of blue jeans. So I do like this one. Do y'all like this one on me? Guys, I feel so dumpy and so depressed with how I have let myself go. I've got to get it under control. It seems like I just keep on inching up and inching up and inching up. Things happen and I didn't get to get, get on that Ozempic like I wanted to. Um, now that I have a car payment, um, it, I found out that it didn't, my insurance didn't cover all of it. So I would have to pay like a weekly fee of whatever the shot cost. So I'm totally, that is a no-go because I can't afford that now. But, um, I just need to start eating better or something. Just something. I'm just so, so, uh, with myself. <laughs> but anyway this is the last shirt and I like this one a whole lot this is a keeper so thank y'all for coming and uh, watching my little Timu haul or me gripe me show y'all um, pretty stuff but mostly griping seems like I gripe a lot lately and I shouldn't. I have nothing to gripe about. I'm blessed. <laughs> I love y'all. And I appreciate y'all so much. Thank y'all for um, supporting my channel. And I'm going to go to uh, the Dollar Tree. And see what they got good in there. So I might be seeing y'all. Probably not this weekend. Because we got a busy weekend planned. Um, and if, oh, if I get a chance, I will record some at the Oktoberfest. Yeah, that'd be fun. So I love y'all and I appreciate y'all so much and I will see you real soon. Bye for now.